Hey guys, John Elder here from tkinter.com, and I've got a quick new artificial intelligence course announcement for you guys and all the members at tkinter.com. So I've created a new course called Create a Video to Text Transcriber App with OpenAI and Kinter. So if you're already a member at tkinter.com, you'll get this course for free as you get all the courses for free once you're a member at tkinter.com. If you're not, I've got a $100 discount for you. Wait till the end of this video to get that. That's uh, join membership so you can get it super cheap. So this is what we're gonna build in this course. It's this cool little app using TTK Bootstrap and Kinter. And what it does is it takes a video, a video file, converts it into an MP3 audio file, then uploads that audio file to OpenAI. And we're gonna use the Whisper One model, artificial intelligence model, to transcribe that audio into text, send the text back to the app, and then you can copy it to your clipboard or save it to a text file. So this is a really, really cool. Another really neat tool that you can use using artificial intelligence and OpenAI and their APIs. If you're familiar with ChatGPT at all, this is sort of an outcropping of that. It's not actually ChatGPT, it's the Whisper One model, which is a slightly different model used for audio transcription and stuff like that. Uh, but this is really, really cool. I'm gonna walk you through absolutely everything in order to build your own copy of this. So why might you want to transcribe video? Oh man, there's just tons of different reasons. If you create video right now and you use different transcription services, you know they're expensive, or you could use like the free one that comes with YouTube when you upload your videos there, but it doesn't work great. You know, you gotta kind of tinker with it. This is pretty good and getting better every day. It uses the same sort of underlying technology that ChatGPT does, the large language model, the LLM, all that good stuff in order to crank out really accurate transcriptions. Now you could take your videos, you can transcribe them. You could just use the transcription with your videos for, you know, closed captioning, of course. You can also take your transcriptions and sort of upload them to a blog, make blog posts out of them. You could use them in social media. You could do just tons of stuff with this and it's really cool. Even if you're not gonna use it, just to learn how to do this with this artificial intelligence open AI model is really cool. You might find some other use for it somewhere. So that's what we're gonna build in this course. And let me walk you through this, a little play around with this a little bit just to see what it does. So you start out, here's the app. We're using TTK Bootstrap to make it look more modern and cool. And first you select your video. So I've got one called AI. And let me see if I can pull this up so you can hear it. So let me just open this. So here's the video that I've got, just a very short little clip, little five second clip. Let me play it, see if you can hear it. What is going on guys? My name is John and today I'm gonna to teach you a little bit about artificial intelligence. So just a very short clip there. So first we open that clip, then we convert it to an MP3. So we click this button and I'm just gonna call this AI2. I've already got a file called that, I'll overwrite it. And you'll notice also it's showing us the file size because OpenAI has a file size limit. It has to be under 25 megabytes. That's why we're converting it into MP3. So the video file is 27 megabytes. Even though it was only five second clip, it was already above their limit. So we have to convert it to an MP3, an audio file. And when we do that, you can see, wow, 0.09, not even one single megabyte. So that's why we do that. Now we're ready to go. We can click this transcribe button and 1001, boom, wasn't even a whole second later, we get a transcription back from OpenAI. It says, hey, what's going on, guys? My name is John, and today I'm gonna to teach you a little bit about artificial intelligence. Now, we can copy this to clipboard. We can click this button. Hey, the text has been copied to clipboard. That's cool. Or we could save it to a text file. I'm just gonna call this saved AI transcript. Go ahead and save that. And yeah, we'll overwrite it. Hey, the text has been saved. Very cool. And then again, we can open this if we want. So we can come to a Windows Explorer. Here's that text file we just saved. If I open it, there it is, and we can do anything we want with it from there. So that's basically what we're gonna be doing in this course. It's a relatively short course, only about 22 videos, I think, but it's a little over an hour long, hour and 20 minutes, something like that. But you're gonna learn everything you need to do this app, and all of this open AI artificial intelligence stuff is just really awesome and getting cooler every day. So this is a fun little thing to learn to get you into that if you're interested in artificial intelligence. So how do you get this course? Well, you can't buy it individually. You have to sign up for tkinter.com membership and get all of my courses. Normally that's $149, but I mentioned there's a coupon code I'm gonna give you today that knocks $100 off of that. So this is a pretty great deal. So you just come to tkinter.com, come down here to the order form page at the bottom of the screen and click on this little carrot thing here to get a coupon code. And then just type in open AI and click apply. Boom, $100 off. Just $49, you get this and all my other courses. What other courses are there? Well, here's membership right here. You log into the website and this is basically what you see. So here is the new course. You could click on that and just start watching it. You can see all of the videos right here. Very cool. We also have a create a text completion chat GPT bot with custom Kinter. 
right here. That's a cool course if you're interested in other artificial intelligence stuff. We've got an intro to Kenter and Python course if you're new to Kenter. We've got a Kenter Paint app, MP3 app. We've got my Kenter Widget book in website form. So you can actually click and download the book there. Or you can come down here to the, let's see, widget library. And it has all of the chapters in the book as web pages. So if you want to learn about the menu widget, you can click on menu widget and read about all of the attributes for it there. It's just the entire book in membership website form. It's very handy. Let's see what else we have. We've got uh, all of my Kodami YouTube playlist is here as well. So there's a bunch of videos there, over 200, I think. All in one nice place, it's really easy to reference. We've also got little tiny Kinter app projects. So there's, I don't know, 10 or 15 little projects you can do watch those videos there. We've got the members only Facebook group and also the code for all of these projects. So check that out if you're interested. $49. It just doesn't get any cheaper than that. And once you're a member, you get all my future courses for free. Current members know when they woke up this morning, boom, this new AI course was just in their dashboard. And you can come back over here and see there's a what's new section. So every time you log in, you check that to say, hey, are there any courses? Because you know, you might not notice a new course just showing up here, but you click on this and it shows, hey, here's the latest courses and the dates and all that stuff. So you can keep track of all that. And it's really cool. So remember this coupon code, OpenAI. It's gonna be available for the next three days. After that, I'm gonna get rid of it and membership goes back to $149. So if you've been thinking about tkinter.com membership, now's a great time to do it and it uh, should be good. So I'm pretty excited about this one. This was a fun one and a lot easier to build than you might think. This artificial intelligence stuff you think, oh, it's very sophisticated. It's really not that sophisticated. It's really not that hard to tap into these APIs and do really cool things, build really cool projects on top of them. And uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. So that's all I wanted to say in this video. Just a little announcement. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the tkinder.com membership area on the Facebook group for members only. And uh, yeah, we'll see you there. So my name is John Elder from tkinter.com and I'll see you in the next video.